It's NFL action live from Tokyo, Japan at the world-famous Krokyo Dome. And the Terminators are being oiled and charged up in anticipation of a successful campaign today. Oh, that sounds like being at the Geisha House massage parlor last night, Grim. Happy ending? Uh, well, if you mean getting tossed into the prana tank in the lobby, yes, they're very happy, Grim. Very happy ending. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Insane Colts go up against the Tokyo Terminators. Have won the GOAT toss and can choose to kick off or receive. And they'll receive the kickoff. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, mm. uh, no, nope, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Yeah, you idiot. And it's first and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. Give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. point attempt it's good the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air scoring makes anyone confident it certainly does bricks it certainly does high five gorgeous kick Better ensure that leg. Who knows how long he'll keep it. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Third down and long. off 
hurting no one. Yeah, if a bomb don't kill anyone, does it still make a sound? Now here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns. Let's see if he beats the other. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. First and ten. It's a snap attack. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, I figured he's that right, Glenn. That penalty makes no sense. Hey, something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. First down and less than a yard. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and ten. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The kick is good. Well, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. And he kicked the snot out of that ball. <laughs> Someone get him a Kleenex. First and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And so, that's the two-minute warning. And it's first and ten. just blew up a player who thought he was going to score. <laughs> oh, that hot potato dirty trick gets him every time. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just 
summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. They've called us half attack. The ball carrier better move. First down! This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think he knows what a first... They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And it's first and ten. And did your mother ever tell you don't run with a chainsaw? Hey, Bricks, what does it feel like to get hit like that? Uh, like being dropped off a 10-story building with a refrigerator strapped to your back and landing on a fire hydrant. Yeah, great analogy. Oh, no, no, that really happened. Cod game. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? Talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. The defender says it's mine, and he comes away with the pick. Fighting for every yard. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Lock and load, baby. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, Here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Here, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right. You should. Second down and ten. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Third and two. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. Get hit 
in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns with seven. What? And kick the kick. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Man, he just kicked the living shit out of that ball. Hey, Clem, I thought that after shit gate, you couldn't inflate your balls with shit no more. Yeah, he don't care. This guy's been a shit baller since he came into the league. And it's first and ten. That's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. Yeah, they're all in politics, apparently. Second and three. First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, telling me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. First and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. At some point, they're going to need to put this ref out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hit. Dirty tricks attack the ref. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. And this is a first and long offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry-up. Uh, same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I... And there's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Mom, Grim, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about shit. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Two minutes remaining in the game. We'll be right back, folks. Jeez, can this game take any longer? I got a date with Hot Wanda after this. Junior, I told you that girl's nothing but trouble. And... 
gonna lick either. Calls timeout. He must be trying to get on their QB's good side. And it's first and ten. Oh man, I love this dirty. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Kick it. In that order, win. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And this guy is one of the best chip kickers in the league. And he just laid into that ball big time. Yeah, like exploding diarrhea. With the brain scrambler. And the offense goes into their two minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match spoopsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. He'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. That run is good for nine yards. Just one time out, so they better bring the ball back gift wrapped. Is it time for a ribbon or a ball grim? Maybe if they use their last time out. Second down and long. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. And that's their last time out. The defense can't bend or break. They've got to get a stop here. Third down and five. Don't worry. If he shots you to death, maybe he can shot you back to life. Fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. And he's off to the races. Catching up. Joke, job, go something. And it's first and ten. He is wrong. If he is getting killed by a team, oh, 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 He's at the 20, the 10, and he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run! <laughs> and 
And they line up for the extra point. Holy shit, a fake kick. The QB threads the needle for two points. The Terminators terminate the opposition and are victorious. It was total and complete and utter domination. And speaking of domination, look at the stilettos on that cheerleader. Ah, I'd let her walk on my back. I'll tell you what, I'll pay her to do a river dance on your back with golf shoes. And let's go to the MVP to hear him let loose with some verbal diarrhea about just how special he is. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy. And all right, gamers, that brings us to the end of yet another video. So do me a favor. If you are watching on Twitch, make sure you hit that follow and the share button. It helps out more than you realize. Then I want you to head on over to our main page, which is found on YouTube. Over there, you can see all of our edited videos. Thumbs up the ones you like. Hit that like and subscribe button. Flicker ding dong so that way you don't miss out on more kick ass content from me and the Gamers Purgatory crew. And until the next video, I will be seeing you. Peace. Oh shit, what up? What? 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 what?